Wonderful people, viewers and subscribers, welcome back again. This is BVI Channel One. Hi, it don't happen. You know, APC is in confusion. PDP is in complete disarray. But let us concentrate on APC. You know, Jagaban came back and he made a an indicting statement to nobody me talk this one it was tinibu the jagaban made this statement and i believe some of you skipped it while he was making that very statement listen to him carefully nigerians should expect that the help they needed is here the hope that is almost teetering is back I'm back actively, and I will hold every effort uh, to the country of patriotism, dedication, capacity, and ability to do the job. Not negative thinking, not the fact that Nigeria has uh, failed. This country, or uh, this continent, is the greatest of all. And we should be a help. If it's rebuilt, we are builders. If it's construction, we are constructed, but constructors. If it is uh, 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 assurance, we give Nigeria that we definitely will make a better country out of it all. I believe you had him. No, it's the fact that Nigeria has uh, failed. Nigeria has uh, failed. Nigeria has uh, failed. Uh -huh. You had it well this time, eh? Good. Nigeria is a failed, we have a failed government. And if you notice, Nigerian people, if you notice, they may not be telling you this, so, <laughs> but Kayama will not go on the media to tell you that <laughs> the house is burning, the APC house is on fire. Because there is war. There is war between Tinibu's campaign camp and his bandwagon of followers in APC and the presidency. It has shifted focus away from issue-based campaigns to amplifying the potential for personal attacks, insults, and incitement. There is war. If you look, you will understand that clearly. There is war. People who are from the presidency, they, they avoid Tinubu and his campaign like a plague. Just like uh, Ingige <laughs> just did in Chinese television. Um, your party, the APC, uh, I'm very, I mean, let me be very certain. Let me not assume. You are still actively in politics, isn't it? Um, I'm not actively in politics. When I withdrew from the presidential race, I said I was going to go and face my work. And you also saw that the work was uh, variegated and multifarious as I came back. So is that the reason About why many you were not were on, strike. on the campaign council? Sorry? Well, I said, is that the basis for you not being included in the campaign council? I'm not in the campaign council. That's I'm, I'm not in the campaign council. And you don't want to be? Why do you say I don't want to be? I don't think uh, I, I'm useful there even because I'm doing a national job that is more important than being in the campaign council. The, uh, the president said we cannot shut down. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, uh, your vice your president, SGF, and a lot of them. So, but, so, so I mean, ministers, that you are not ministers, acti uh, actively participating in politics now doesn't mean that you are not still supporting your party's candidate. How difficult is it for you to support uh, your party's candidate now that you say you're not? Really actively participating in politics, and you have your very you, good you, friend. You, Just a moment, Minister. Okay. You have your very good friend uh, Peter Obi as a candidate of the Labour Party at the time that uh, the people, head of the obedient people. <laughs> <laughs> at the point that people in your region are clamoring for an Igbo president. Now that you have one, how difficult is it for you to support Bola Tinubu as against Peter Obi? Is it difficult? Share, share with you like boxing people into a corner. I've told you I'm not active. You, you even noticed that that I'm not active in politics for now, but I'm facing national assignment. Why are you asking me a difficult question? Is, is it difficult? Both of them are, are, are my friends now from what you've said. What would you choose? No, forget it. Uh, my choice will be in the ballot box. On the day of ballot, I make my choice. Yeah, you, you vote your conscience. Forget it. 
whether conscience or no conscience, that day mm -hmm. in February, one vote. So it's not, it's not, you cannot tell Nigerians that you are voting your candidate. That's what you're saying right now. Why do you say so? It's well, a, it's a, it's a secret ballot. I, I shouldn't tell, tell Nigerians what uh, <laughs> I will do secretly. All right. So uh, if you look at the crystal ball, who do you think can win this election? Well, the way the parties have problem, hmm. the big parties, we have problem in the PC. PDP have their own. Their own is two times our own. That tells you more. For Ngige to say this, for Ngige to say, can we forget not to even have boldness to say I am voting our party candidates Tinibu at the election? If he cannot boldly come out to tell you, <laughs> just know that there is fire on the mountain, just know that there is problem. Okay, mm -hmm. we know the one that Shetima threw at the vice president. Osipanjo is a good man, he's a nice man. But nice men do not make good leaders because nice men tend to be nasty. Nice men should be selling popcorn, ice cream, and balabobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobobob
much for hope. There is no part that will not get this message. Secretariat to hope. Secretariat. Market to hope. Market. Party to hope. Party. Church to hope. Church. Mosque to hope. Mosque. School to hope. School. University to hope. University. The Nigerian people are. with your vote. I'm signing out. Don't forget to subscribe. Share this video. Mm -hmm. Share this video. Any obedient person you see, ask the person, have you collected your PVC? Now, dear, we're there now. Bye bye.